The Energy Transition and Water Transformation Ministry will hold an engagement session with stakeholders, including industry players, government agencies and non-governmental organizations on August 22nd, before announcing charges for third-party access to Malaysia's electricity grid. Deputy Prime Minister Dato Sri Fadila Yusuf said the government is in the final stages of preparing the Corporate Renewable Energy Supply Scheme, which is scheduled for completion next month. So how much? We have not finalized, not until we, we had all the, uh, the uh, engagement with the industry players to get the input and so on. We have the figure, but we cannot publish that figure until it's finalized and agreed upon by all the sectors. He said this at a press conference during the 6th International Sustainable Energy Summit 2024. The summit was organized by the Sustainable Energy Development Authority of Malaysia on August 20th and 21st at the Kuala Lumpur Convention Center. Fadila said the government would continue to expedite and enhance implementation of an open grid mechanism, facilitating increased access to green electricity for businesses through third-party corporate purchase agreements. Strategically transition away from a single buyer model for renewable energy or RE development to effectively de-risk the national electricity supply systems, fostering greater participation and competition within the power supply industry and among RE stakeholders. Fadila emphasized that the shift will foster a competitive market for renewable energy, leading to cost reductions, enhanced investor confidence, and accelerated deployment of clean energy technologies. He noted that the government will continue to promote the development and deployment of non-solar renewable energy resources such as biogas, biomass, and mini hydro to diversify the country's power generation sources while ensuring energy system security and reliability.